Working with tickets in Zendesk. A ticket is a conversation between a customer and your company. Unlike other conversations, however, a ticket is a conversation which can be solved. Let's see how it's done. Whenever a customer contacts you through one of the eight Zendesk channels, a ticket is created automatically and can be found here in your views. Views are customizable collections of tickets. All new tickets show up here in the All Unsolved Tickets view. Solving tickets involves two basic activities, organization and conversation. First, organization. Every Zendesk ticket has a requester and an assignee. The requester is the person who contacted you, usually the customer. The assignee is the person in your company currently responsible for the ticket. You can switch the assignee at any time depending on who is best equipped to solve the ticket, which might be you. Ticket assignment is an important part of how Zendesk works, and a ticket must have an assignee in order to be solved. The other fields are optional, but help with organization and workflow automation later on. For more on that, follow the link at the end of the video. The conversation happens over here. Reply to the customer, and include any other colleagues by adding them to the CC field. When you submit a comment to a ticket, you also choose its status. The status of the ticket determines whether it needs further attention or not. A new ticket means it hasn't been assigned to anyone yet. An open ticket means the assignee still needs to work on it. Pending means you are waiting on more information from the customer. Solved means, well, solved, uh, you're done for, for now. If the customer still has a question and responds again to the ticket, Zendesk will automatically reopen it. In this case, it's pending. Once you submit, the customer and anyone you've CC'd receives an email with the comment. If any of them reply to that email, the ticket will be updated and the discussion will continue until the issue is solved. And that's all it takes to work with a ticket. A couple other things that are helpful to know. First, you can add an internal note to any ticket which is visible only to your agents, not your customer. Any agent who is CC'd on the ticket will get an email update when you submit that internal note. But keep in mind that if your colleague replies to the email, by default, their comment will be visible to the customer. You can change that and do lots of other advanced pro stuff, and you'll find information on that in our forums. Also, you can create a new ticket manually. Just enter the requester information yourself, assign it to an agent if you're ready to do that, add ticket details, and submit. In this case, both the requester and assignee will get an email with the ticket subject and description. Okay, those are the basics of working with tickets in Zendesk. There's more you can do, and for that, check out the link at the end of the video or search in our forums. And if you have any further questions, you can always email us at 